Hey guys, Roman at Car Tips here once again with another video. I got an update for you guys. I went ahead and I uh, made a purchase. I bought a new car. This here is my new vehicle. It's an 07 Subaru WRX. And uh, I'm really excited to try and drive it. Uh, it's almost done. I'm at the painting stage. So today's video, I'll just show you guys how I'm painting this World Rally Blue. into this door as well as the bumper cover. So the story with this car is that I found this vehicle wrecked and um, it was wrecked in the quarter panel as well as the suspension. I have already changed uh, multiple suspension parts including the uh, shock, um, you know, control arms, that kind of stuff. Initially, I got it for $4,400, and uh, by the time I'm done with it, uh, it cost me around six, just a little over, pretty much six grand. And that, of course, includes all the parts and the materials, everything that costs up to six grand. Of course, I didn't count my own labor, but you know, it's, it's a car for me, so I'm, I'm just doing it for myself. Anyway, this is how the car looked. As you can tell, it's quite a bit of work. Well, not too much if you're an auto body guy, but um, yeah, it's drivable, you know, so I did have to uh, work quite a bit with that quarter panel. Ideally, you're supposed to change the skin on this kind of a repair, but I went ahead and I just uh, straightened it out, pulled it out, um, and did some, you know, panel sheet metal work to it. And of course, you know, the body work, the body filler, Bondo, some people call it, is what I applied. and primed it and now it's time to paint. So as you can see the first coat comes on really transparent. You don't want to uh, you know spray it on nice and heavy and have it leak. So yeah it takes a few coats to cover it and when it flash dries I grab a tack cloth uh, as usual tack down the surface, uh, removing all kinds of debris, dust, and you know, particles from the air uh, that may contaminate the surface. Uh, go over in another few coats and just kind of blend it. It's pretty much how, uh, pretty much how a car, any car is painted really. This color is actually really expensive. It has a lot of pearl in it. Even though it's a uh, you know, base coat, clear coat, two stage paint job, uh, the base contains a lot of pearls, so it actually comes out really transparent if you don't put enough layers on. Um, but in the, um, in the end result, it looks really beautiful in the sun. I've got that uh, metallic sparkle pearl shimmer, you know, out in the sunlight. Looks really good, but expensive. This paint is very expensive, so yeah. World Rally Blue. Um, 02C, I believe, is the color code from Subaru. I really like this color. If uh, for, you know you're buying a STI or a WRX, you know Turbo Subaru, this is the staple blue color. This is the color I had to have, so I bought this car. Not for the color, but um, yeah, it's a good color, I think. Also, actually planning to paint the rims or Plasti Dip, one or the other. I don't, I haven't decided yet. Uh, in the future, uh, make them gold. You know, so that World Rally Blue with the gold, gold wheels looks pretty good in my opinion. Uh, some may say it's like a teenager boy uh, <laughs> setup, but I don't know. I, I think it's Subaru Rally heritage color, so I really like it. So I'm planning on doing that. Uh, stick around and uh, keep an eye out for that video to be dropping sometime soon.
So now, as I've said earlier, I'm actually blending, um, just feathering it out to the to that side, uh, just so the color matches the uh, old one here. Kind of applying a, like a lighter coat, just misting on um, like a lighter coat, just so it looks uniform across the whole side. And this is the clearing stage. I decided to fast forward it real quick because uh, it would take way too long for a video. If you're interested in seeing how to uh, apply clear coat correctly, uh, just how to do a complete pearl paint job in general, uh, check out this video at the top right corner. Um, yeah, that, that's like a full tutorial video on how to paint pearl and clear. So check it out if you want. So I usually apply two coats of clear, and uh, this is up to two coats. Turned out pretty good. I uh, got a couple uh, dust specks there anyway, but nothing a uh, little polish won't buff out. Um, here's a hint, take off this uh, trim tape. When you mask, mask like, uh, like a, leave a little bit of an edge. And I've mentioned this in uh, some of my earlier videos. Uh, it just keeps the paint from bridging together and curing. And then, um, yeah, just right after your paint job, within five, 10 minutes or whatever, peel off that trim tape so, you know, the clear, if you, if you like laid it on nice and heavy, it doesn't bridge together to the body. Little bonus tip. So here's how the final finished product looks like. I'm really proud of my job. Installed the bumper, all the parts, little pieces, clips here and there, interior parts. Uh, yeah, looks pretty good, I think. I can't wait to drive it. <laughs> like I said, if you wanna see the video of how I paint my wheels gold or plastic dip, one or the other, I'll be dropping that video soon, depending on if I decide to do it. Uh, just like I said, keep an eye out for that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching my video. I hope it helped. Hope you guys enjoyed, maybe found it entertaining. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. All that would be appreciated. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.